loin d'abord. Hi guys, welcome to a little product introduction and video review on the Black Ops B1084. This is a 1911 steel BB gun, blowback, really nicely designed. Um, I gotta say, I actually really like the gun. Now, if you're a fan of the 1911, you're probably gonna end up liking this video because this is an outstanding little pistol. Um, all metal construction has quite a bit of weight to it. It has a uh, operating slide it locks back on last shot um, the plastic is actually in the grips these are plastic but everything else is metal metal screws uh, you have metal throughout the gun actually the barrel looks sort of stainless steel you have the slider release that operates the trigger the uh, safeties all work the grip safety the rear safety all manipulate correctly and uh, operate well if I put it on safe, like it is now, you can't pull the trigger. Take it off safe, can't pull the trigger unless you operate the rear grip safety, and then it fires. Now, the gun, as it sits, is actually very safe itself because the magazine holds the CO2 and the BBs. So once you release the magazine, take it out, you know that the gun's not going to fire or anything like that because everything else is in here. Um, the magazine is very small, very compact, uses an Allen wrench key to tighten down the CO2 and I didn't have any bleed off on it, it tightened it really quick so that's actually really nice. Um, the BBs hold 18 BBs and uh, it works out really cool. Like I said, on the last BB it's going to lock back the slide so you know you're empty. Uh, to do magazine changeouts, that's probably the one thing that this gun's going to make me do is actually buy more magazines because it's really cool to slam the magazine home, you know, and change out the mags once the gun's locked back to the slide. Um, so probably going to have to end up going to the uh, Black Ops website to buy more mags. But other than that, it's a really great gun. Um, it came with everything you see, uh, extra BBs, um, the gun, the Allen wrench, and not the CO2. There was no C CO2 uh, that came with the gun. But the gun itself, like I said, is all metal construction, really nicely designed. And if you like the 1911, you're going to love this thing. Um, it does break down. You can take it apart to clean it and stuff if you want to. I'm not going to do that currently on camera just because it takes a little while. And I haven't really taken it apart completely. Um, just remove the slide. So the uh, overall gun... It doesn't really hit that hard. I'm not going to use this for hunting. It's definitely a training tool, uh, something to familiarize people with the 1911 design and the operations of the gun. It works out great for that. Uh, it's fun to shoot in the backyard. I mean, hours of plinking time. Uh, I actually went through a couple of CO2 cartridges already with this gun and haven't had any hiccups or problems. Um, like I said, it's not really good with steel cans. I mean, it'll definitely ding them up and dent them up, but it's not going to pierce them too much. Um, the uh, soda cans the, are going to just be torn up with this, so they work out really great. Um, water bottles, it won't penetrate all the way, but it will definitely puncture you on know, one side. With that said, the Black Ops 1911 is outstanding. I really like the gun. If you have a chance to pick one up, I definitely say to do it, um, especially if you like the 1911 design. For me, my very first pistol was a 1911. Uh, I ended up getting rid of it because it was so expensive to shoot. I mean, ammunition cost plus college at the time was just too expensive to uh, to own it, and I ended up getting rid of it. With this type of pistol, it's sort of a bad thing too because you fall back in love with that design or that familiarity with the pistol and. Uh, I ended up wanting to buy another one. So with that said, um, those are the only drawbacks. It makes you want to go out and buy a regular 1911. 
Uh, that is a look at the Black Ops B1084. Any questions, feel free to ask. You guys have a good one. Be safe, take care, and I'll definitely talk to you soon.